As these cases demonstrate, the government of China sought to interfere with the rights and freedoms of individuals in the United States and to undermine our judicial system that protects those rights. They did not succeed. The Justice Department will not tolerate attempts by any foreign power to undermine the rule of law upon which our democracy is based. We will continue to fiercely protect the rights guaranteed to everyone in our country, and we will defend the integrity of our institutions. First, let me begin by pointing out that 10 of the 13 charged individuals we're discussing today are Chinese intelligence officers and Chinese government officials. They're charged in three different cases that might seem at first glance to be about unrelated issues. However, and this is something that I've been talking about for years now, each of these cases lays bare the Chinese government's flagrant violation of international laws as they work to project their authoritarian view around the world, including within our own borders. We also see a coordinated effort across the Chinese government to lie cheat and steal their way into unfairly dominating entire technology sectors, putting competing U.S. companies out of business. The cases unsealed today take place against a backdrop of malign activity from the People's Republic of China that includes espionage, harassment, obstruction of our justice system, and unceasing efforts to steal sensitive U.S. technology. In the words of our intelligence community, China seeks to be a major power on the world stage and to challenge the United States in multiple arenas. Today's cases make clear that Chinese, Chinese agents will not hesitate to break the law and to violate international norms in the process.